5 over 8 as a decimal 5 8 as a decimal however to convert this fraction to decimal you have to divide this numerator by denominator so let us do that this right so look this 8 is greater than this 5 so we'll take like this we will we can write 5 like 5 decimal 0 or 5 decimal 0 0 or 5 decimal 0 0 0 or 5 decimal 0 0 0 0 that is you can take any number of zeros uh, if you need right the value of this is 5 the value of this is 5 so look so uh, I can rewrite this like this you can take any number of zeros according to your need so look five eight doesn't go into five so that is eight goes into five zero times so zero times uh, eight that is zero if you subtract then you will get five now you you have to bring down this zero look if you bring down this zero before zero you have decimal so this decimal will come here right so now 8 goes into uh, 50 how many times so we need multiplication table so 8 times 1 that gives us 8 8 times 2 that gives us 16 that is you have to add 8 with this uh, a, a, you have to add 8 with this 8 then you will get this 3 8 times 3 that gives us what 24 that is you have to add 8 with this 16 then you will get 24 right this is easy so then 4 32 that is if you add 8 with this 24 you will get this then 5 40 right 40 and 6 48 just you have to add 8 with the, you are getting 48 then 7 what will happen here 56 right this 56 look here we have 50 but if if I, if I multiply 8 by 7, I will get 56. So, which is greater? So, we will consider this step. 8 times 6, that gives us 48. Right? 48. 6. So, if I take here 6, 6 times 8, that is uh, 48. Right? 48. So if you subtract what will happen 2 now bring down this 0 here so 8 goes into 20 how many times look here 8 times 3 24 8 times 3 24 but 8 times 2 which is greater than 20 so you have to consider this step 8 times 2 16 so 2 then 2 times 8 16 if you subtract then what will happen 4 then bring down this 0 so 8 goes into 40 how many times look here consider this step 5 times 8 times 5 40 that is 5 then 40 subtract you will get 0 right so look you don't need to write this 0 here because already you are getting remainder 0 right so you don't need this you can write this so if you express 5 over 8 as a decimal you will get 0 0.625 this is the answer